what's up and good afternoon guys welcome back to another video today we're going to continue working on the trash kayak and get it uh, fixed up and done uh, we got a lot of cleaning to do on the inside of it we're going to try and do that today and get that completely done and and uh, washed out and cleaned uh, I got the tops cleaned out and put back on I'm going to end up having to take uh, I don't think I'll take the front one off but I'll have to take this back one off for sure um, and then we'll clean out that compartment as well and we'll get that done we got some uh, new drain plugs to put on the kayak so we got one to put on the front and then we got one to put back here on the back to do and then once we get done with all that then we'll put on the new uh, lime green bungees that uh, we got in the mail but for now I want to do the cleaning port of it because I don't want to get the bungees all nasty and dirty so um, let's go ahead put it on time lapse and then we'll start the cleaning of the inside of the kayak and get it all done and get it gone all right so let me uh, set the camera to time lapse and then we'll be right back Okay guys, we got the back end of it all cleaned out, and uh, this front compartment here is quite a mess. Uh, got a bunch of leaves and grass and some more dirt back in it from the rain. So I'm gonna, I've gone ahead and sprayed it out and let it sit here for a couple minutes, let the bleach kind of wear in, and uh, then we'll take and we'll scrub it. All right, we'll be back here in just a second. Okay guys, we got the inside of it all cleaned out now. It looks really, really, really good. I uh, hope y'all can hear me over the wind. Sorry if it's uh, a little windy in the mic. Uh, but anyway, the inside of it looks really, really nice now. It's really cleaned out. Uh, let me take you off the tripod here and uh, undo the mic and we'll uh, show you inside the kayak what it looks like now. Okay, so all right. So here is the inside of the back of it. If you remember, there used to be a big water line in here. It used to be really, really nasty. Now it looks really, really clean in there. And then down in here, if you remember, it had this big like bathtub ring looking thing all the way down inside of it. And uh now, as you can see, it's really, really nice down in there. It's all cleaned out. Looks good. Got a little bit of dirt in there, but that's just from everything that I washed out of it. If you remember back up in here, how nasty it was back behind on uh, both sides there. But, uh, yeah, she looks good now. Uh, throw the seat up here. Show you the seat compartment here. We go around the other side so the sun's a little bit crazy so all right so as you can see here on the seat this whole seat was just black and nasty had a lot of uh, tree sap and mud and mold and mildew now that the bleach has washed all that out there's a little spot like right there um, that's still a little bit moldy but uh, I think as time goes over, the uh, bleach will take care of that. But uh, yeah, look at that, how clean that is back up in there now. And then 
that side there all nice and cleaned out looks really really good guys all right let me flip the camera around okay guys so we got the uh, kayak all cleaned out everything looks really really good sorry for the wind noise I can't help it it's super windy out here so if you're hearing a lot of wind noise I'm sorry about that um, Anyway, the kayak looks pretty good, all cleaned out. Now we just got to get the uh, the plugs put back on it, and uh, let me go ahead and set the camera back up on the tripod. We'll get the uh, plugs put on it, and then we'll come back out and we'll put on the uh, the new bungees that we got for it. So stay tuned. Give me a second, and we'll be right back. Okay, I got the kayak all. I mean, I got the uh, tripod all lowered down. I'm going to go ahead and clean out these holes real quick. Alright. Now then, let me go get the uh, drain plug. So we got the new drain plug in hand. I'll go ahead and pop it on here. There like that. Get it all lined up. Find the holes here. There we go. There's that one. Now we got the plug ready to go. Just take it and uh, screw it in. And just like that, we got a new plug put in it. I'm going to go ahead and leave that undone for now. So that way, any bit of water that's in here will dry out. Now, I've already replaced the back one, I did that one off of camera. Uh, this one here took me a little bit to do so the thing with this one was is I actually had to uh, reuse the bolts that were here and uh, so I had to reach up in here inside with a wrench and tighten these down and they're still a little bit loose but it's okay so that was a little bit of a pain to do that because I had to reach down inside the uh, the kayak right over here to uh, to get into it. So I had to reach up inside there with a with a wrench and a uh, screwdriver to take care of that. So that one there is all done. I'm gonna leave it unplugged for now. That way the water can drain out of it. I may end up having to replace these handles at some point, so that will probably be the, the next project. Um, so we'll see about that if they last or not. But for now, kayak is all cleaned up, looks good. So there's that. Now this is the uh, Equinox 10 and a half foot kayak. Uh, for those that want to know, push that leg back out there, get it back even. There we go. I'm gonna raise this back up. Okay guys, so we got the front compartment all cleaned out, we got the back compartment all cleaned out. Um, everything looks pretty good. Got a little bit of dirt on it, but that's mostly from the, the rain. Got all the nastiness washed off of it. Um, so, 
Next thing to do is to uh, get the bungees put on here, and we'll do that. And uh, give me a second, let me go get the bungees real quick, and then we'll start putting those on. Show you what it looks like. So give me a minute here, and we'll be right back. Okay guys, we're back, and uh, here's the bungees that we ended up going with. This nice neon green against that yellow is going to pop. It's going to make it really look good. So uh, what I'm going to do is go ahead and undo one of the tips here. We'll start fishing it through and get it going, and we'll cut it as necessary. Alright, so let me uh, move the camera over here. that okay there we go all right and then I'm gonna go ahead get this end done and then we'll start fishing this reef Set that back out of the way. Come up here, we'll tie these. So, right, so we tie a little knot in the end of it like that right there. And then this one will go there, and that one will go there. Just like that right there we go. Oh, look at that. That looks really good, guys. Alright, so there's the front one, and that looks way better than it did, that's for sure. I really like that green against it, that really pops, makes it look nice. I may have to tie those different, but for now that'll work.
right, here we go. That green against that yellow really pops. I like it. I really like the way that looks, guys. Now, the only thing we got left to do is the bungee here that holds the uh, kayak paddle. So, we need to go ahead and do that now. So, let me move the tripod back and we'll uh, start that now. So there we go. We got the kayak paddle holder on. And it all looks pretty good. So that's good and tight now. We got tight bungees up there. They're all looking good. So yeah, looks good, guys. So the camera back. Let's set it up a little bit here. Raise it up a little bit. Bungees really pop against that now. It makes it really look nice. Alright, let me get the other cover for uh, this one back here and put it on, and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so inside of it's all cleaned out. We got the uh, new bungees on it. We got both the covers on it. 
everything looks really, really nice. And I think that green really pops against that. I think it really makes it look nice. So, the only thing it's really left to do now is I'm going to find some kind of a replacement seat for it. that's it guys i think that's all i've got for you for today appreciate y'all joining me again for the trash kayak we'll got one more thing to do to it which is the seat so once we get a seat for it we'll put that in and then the next thing will be after that will be water trials see how it holds up on the water and uh, we'll get it out on the lake and go try it out so all right guys that is all i've got for you for today as always I'm Red Fox with Red Fox Outdoors. Get out and enjoy nature. Bye, guys.